If you're looking to make extra cash in 2022, you need to try out these side hustles. Some of them are quite weird. Some of them are quite fun. And some of them are really easy money. But they're all legit ways of making extra cash in 2022. And the best part is they're all 100% free. You won't find any of the usual boring side hustles in this video. Boring! No reselling items, no Airbnb, and no affiliate marketing. These are all different. Let's dive into it. Number one is drinking beer and watching TV. Now this sounds too good to be true, but just hear me out. I did this years ago when I was broke and I got paid 45 pounds, which is about $50, for testing out a new beer which was coming onto the market. I can hear lots of people saying, how can I do this? How can I sign up to this? Well, I'm obviously talking about market research and there's lots of companies out there which will pay people to kind of test out their products and provide feedback. There's lots of companies offering this on Google, like this one called Take Part in Research, and they've got so many different projects that you can sign up to, like this alcohol one, and also this TV subscription project. Now here's the good news. When I did it years ago, I had to actually go to a place with a group of people and review the products. Now, because of COVID and because of the internet, you can now do it from the comfort of your own home on Zoom. Sometimes they send you the products or sometimes they just ask you questions on products that you're already using. Number two is playing with dogs. Now I know this one because I've actually been trying out the app. My <laughs> Number two is playing with dogs. <laughs> uh you don't wanna play then. Yeah, you can literally get paid for playing with dogs and looking after dogs. There's a website called rover.com, which allows you to sign up. And when someone needs someone to look after their dog or maybe check on the dog while they're at work, or sometimes it might be an overnight stay at your house with the dog, they can get in touch with you and they actually pay you out cash to do that. So if you're a dog lover and you wanna earn some extra cash, then definitely check out rover.com. Number three is waiting in line. Now we all hate queuing up for things. Ain't nobody got time for that. But imagine if you was paid to queue up, would you do it? Yeah! Well, you actually can get paid for queuing up and waiting in line for other people. This guy earns $200 per day just by queuing up for people. If you want to do this, you can offer your service on a website like taskrabbit.com and people, if they want to maybe buy the latest games console, but they can't be bothered to wait in the queue, they can outsource it to you and pay you some money for waiting in line. Number four is turn your car into a billboard. Yeah, that's right. You can earn some extra cash by having adverts on the outside of your car. There's a few companies that offer this service, such as Advertu and Carvertise, and basically they'll allow you to wrap your vehicle in a certain campaign advertisement, and as you're driving around, they'll track your movement using a phone app, and then they pay you out a lump sum every month. Advertu say that on average, their users make around about 150 pounds per month, which is around about $200, which isn't bad, and it's a bit of extra cash in the pocket if you're just using your car to drive to and from work every day. Number five, while we're in the car, is rent out your car parking space. Now, maybe you don't actually have a car, but you've still got a car parking space where you live, or maybe you do have a car, but you're at work all day, so you don't need the space in the day. Well, you can actually make good money by renting out your car parking space. There's quite a few different sites where you can list your car parking space online, such as Just Park and also Spacer, and you can earn up to like $450 per month by offering out your space to other people. Number six is assembling flat pack furniture. Now, I absolutely hate assembling flat pack furniture. In fact, I actually paid someone to come and assemble this set of drawers for me the other day, and yeah, I am just pretending to do it just for this video. But if you don't mind doing it, then there's definitely plenty of opportunity out there to offer this as a service. Websites like Bark and TaskRabbit, I've got this as a service on there and it's one of their best selling services because people don't like doing it. And if you are all right with an Allen key or a screwdriver, then definitely think about offering this as a service because you can make a nice bit of side income from it. Number seven is get paid to shop. Now I'm not talking about cash back or reward points. No, you can literally get paid by heading to your local shop and completing random tasks. There's an app called Roamla, which is a free app, and it gives you random tasks to go and complete at local shops and stores, such as going to check if items are in stock, checking the quality of those items, or simply just reviewing the service as a whole. You go back to the app and they actually pay you small amounts of money each time you complete a task. Now, this isn't gonna make you rich, but I was looking at reviews online and someone managed to make over 3,000 pounds in just one year of using this app. If Roamla's not available in your country, there's also lots of other apps out there like secretshopper.com where they pay you out to go and 
review shops and certain products and things like that while you're out and about. The next one is getting paid to wait around. Now this is the ultimate side hustle for the lazy people out there. There's nothing worse than waiting for a delivery and being told it'll be with you between 8 a.m. and 8 p.m., especially if you've got work to do or you're busy. Well, now what a lot of people are doing when they can't be waiting around for deliveries, they're actually paying other people to wait around for them. There's lots of people offering this as a service on websites like taskrabbit.com. There's plenty of opportunity out there if you wanna do this yourself, and it is a great side hustle because you're getting paid to wait around. If you wanna be extra clever and make extra money, then it's a really good idea to actually be doing other side hustles during in that time while you're waiting around rather than just chilling and, and reading books but it's entirely up to you Friday, gotta get down on Friday. The next one is get paid to listen to music. Now, I'm gonna be honest, this one is not gonna make you super, super rich, but there is a website out there which allows you to listen to music and review those tracks, and you can get paid money for doing this. The website's called Slice the Pie, and they pay average between 10 to 20 cents per song, so you can make around about one to two dollars per hour. So as I said, this is not gonna make you quit your job or anything like that, but you could potentially do this along Side one of the other side hustles like waiting in line or waiting for packages for someone else and you can make some nice side income from it. Usually you just need to listen to 90 seconds of the song before you submit a review and they just need to give a bit of feedback on like the vocals, what you thought of the song and also if you would add it to your playlist and you can get paid out money for that. I think the minimum payout is $10. Once you hit $10, you can receive the money in your PayPal. That's right, I've saved the crap one for last. Gary Vee is famous for saying you should eat shit until you make it. I want you to eat shit for the next second. I just eat shit constantly. But maybe you should actually just pick up shit until you make it. Because this is an actual, real, legit side hustle that you can make a lot of money from. This guy charges $45 per week to come to your yard or your garden and pick up after your dog. So if you don't mind getting down and dirty, this could be the perfect side hustle for you. You can literally just turn up to someone's yard with a shovel or a pair of gloves and some bags and you've got a fully fledged side hustle that you can make some good money from. Oh, and by the way, this was just a fruit and nut bar. Although it has been on the floor. So there you have it. That's my list of side hustles for 2022. I hope you enjoyed this video. And even if you liked just one of the side hustles, all I ask is that you please smash the like button because it really, really helps me out. If you're not subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And also, if you try any of the side hustles out, let me know how it goes in the comments below because I always read all comments. And if you think of any other side hustles that you want me to try out or feature in future videos, then please also let me know in the comments below. Until next time, cheers guys.